Race amity combined with education is the key to the future of this country. We have a very diverse uh, demographic situation in, in the United States, increasingly demographic. And we have to know each other. We have to learn to live with each other. We have to respect each other. We have to uh, recognize our differences, but respect those differences. Understand that we don't all have to come from the same cultural background or the same ideological background. Well, we do come from the same uh, basic ground, background of being a human being. Uh, we're all members of one race. We are members of the human race. And I think uh, in states such as mine, the state of Mississippi, highest uh, percentage of African Americans of any state in the nation. This country as a whole, perhaps the most diverse democracy in the world, I think it is a key to our ability to exist as a great nation, where people understand uh, the diversity of their backgrounds and their race, but at the same time, the commonality of their interests, uh, the, uh, the absolute necessity of learning to respect each other and to know that uh, uh, out of that out of that understanding will come a relationship, a, a total human relationship that will put down so many of the biases and prejudices that we are still afflicted with. This country is too rich, it has too many great resources, too many great people uh, to be handicapped by a continued uh, uh, racial bias. Uh, the strength, the strength of this country lies in its diversity. And I think it's a key to our future. And, I, and, and a younger generation must learn that. And, and, and race amity is at the background, is at the very base of accomplishing that result. And unless we accomplish that result, we're not going to be as great a people as we ought to be.